great. We're extraordinary and excellent in Christ Jesus. King David and Samson defeated their enemies with God's help. But now there is a new covenant. Jesus fulfilled the law. Love thy neighbor as thyself, summed up in scripture. Thou shalt not kill. Romans chapter 13, verses 9 through 14. It is written, For this thou shalt not commit adultery. Thou shalt not kill. Thou shalt not steal. Thou shall not bear false witness. Thou shall not cover. And if there be any other commandment, it is briefly comprehended in this saying, namely, Thou shalt love thy neighbor as thyself. Love worketh no ill to his neighbor. Therefore, love is the fulfilling of the law and that knowing the time that now it is high time to awake out of sleep for now is our salvation nearer than when we believed the night is far spent the day is at hand let us therefore cast off the works of darkness and let us put on the armor of light. That's Jesus. Hallelujah. Let us walk honestly as in the day, not in rioting and drunkenness, not in chambering and wantonness, not in strife and envying. But put ye on the Lord Jesus Christ and make not provision for the flesh to fulfill the lust thereof. John chapter 18 verses 7 through 9 It is written, Then asks he them again, Whom seek ye? And they said, Jesus of Nazareth. Jesus answered, I have told you that I am he. If therefore ye seek me, let these go their way. Speaking of his disciples, that the saying might be fulfilled, which he spake of them which thou gavest me, have I lost none. Jesus said, For all they that take the sword shall perish with the sword. Matthew chapter 26 verses 51 through 53 It is written, And behold, one of them which were with Jesus stretched out his hand and drew his sword and struck a servant of the high priest and smote off his ear. Then said Jesus unto him, Put up again thy sword into his place, for all they that take the sword shall perish with the sword. Thinkest thou that I cannot now pray to my father and he shall presently give me more than 12 legions of angels nothing will happen unless God permit it and Peter is the one that smote off his ear and Jesus placed it back on give your life to Jesus because he is our only hope and the day we're living in today. Then Peter said unto them, Repent and be baptized, 
every one of you in the name of Jesus Christ for the remission of sins and ye shall receive the gift of the Holy Ghost. Violence is not the answer. Jesus is love. You have a blessed day.